Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing some work on the front end of my ATES Traxxas X Max. So recently uh, I've made a couple trips down to Arc Raceway because I'm trying to learn uh, the front flip. So if you haven't tried a front flip yourself, uh, they're actually really hard with an RC car because sometimes what happens is you slam on the brake, it does the flip but then it can kind of rotate sideways. away. So what happens is that it can nose dive into the ground or it can even worse land on its corner. So while I've been learning, uh, that has happened a couple times. So we have actually caused some quite substantial damage to the front of the car. So let me just quickly show you the damage. So for starts, we've got a broken bulkhead. As you can see here, the skid plate isn't sitting right. The whole front end's twisted and it actually wobbles from side to side look. So that's definitely a completely battered front bulkhead. And it's also actually done the upper front bulkhead. So let me just quickly put the truck over so you can see that. Here we go, you can see in there, it's all split along the top of that upper bulkhead. So definitely a completely done in front bulkhead. Next, we've managed to trash the front shock tower as well. If we just take a look down here, look. It's all split and that's all wobbling there and it's done the same on the other side here, look. That little part there where the shock tower connects onto the bulkhead has just snapped clean off that shock tower there. And then finally, uh, we have managed to break the front top arm. As you can see, a little chunks come off it there, but the screw has stayed in so we didn't actually lose the pin. So we've got all the parts here. We've got the new top arm, front upper and lower bulkheads and the new shock tower. So without further ado, let's begin. Here we go, that's the front end separated, so now let's get it stripped down. Look at that guys, you can really see just how broken this front bulkhead is. I mean, it's broken right from the bottom here all the way to the top of the upper bulkhead here. I mean, look how bad that is. That is literally like it snapped in half, look. So here we can see those two little parts that snapped off the end of the shock tower there, look. Yeah, greasy work gifts are. So here we go, we've got this thing stripped down to just the bulkheads here. As you can see here, this upper bulkhead is completely trashed. Look at that split right across. And then we've got that lower bulkhead here split all the way down the side, look. So with the old bulkhead all stripped down now, we can fit the new one. So here we've got the new upper bulkhead, guys. Next, we're going to be installing the new shock tower. And finally, we're going to be fitting the new top arm.
So there we go, guys. That is the X Max fully put back together. So here is the total damage of those last few outings. And if I'm honest, it's not too bad considering how hard some of those impacts are because in order to be able to do the front flip, you've got to have some momentum. So the car's traveling fast and then for it to come out right down on its corner, especially of a car of that size, it's very heavy. I, I don't think this is too bad. So as we gain experience with the front flips, hopefully we shouldn't do this much damage again. So there we go, guys. That's the X-Max all repaired, ready for another session. And I've actually got something quite special planned for this car, which should hopefully be a good bit of fun. So if you want to watch that, make sure that you subscribe and that you press the notification bell. But for now, that tops it off for this video. I really do hope you did enjoy it. Make sure you hit leave like and subscribe. If you haven't already subscribed, then make sure to do that. And make sure that you press the notification bell so you don't miss any other cool action. So that's it from me. I hope you have a brilliant day or week ahead. And I'll see you all next time in the next video. Bye.